Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Timur Jabo and Ding Liren. This is a game from the finals of the World Cup 2019, and this is the second blitz game. Rajabo had white pieces and he started with e4. Ding Liren played c5, the Sicilian defense. Knight to f3, the standard move. d6, d4, c takes on d4. Knight takes on d4, knight to f6, knight to c3, knight to c6, white to move, bishop to g5 and bishop to c4 are the two most played moves. Rajabo played bishop to e2, going for the Bolesavsky variation. e5, attacking the knight, knight to b3. Black has a backward pawn on d6, but it will be compensated by the activity of the pieces. Bishop to e7. Bishop to g5, castling. Bishop takes on f6, removing the defender of the d5 square. Bishop takes on f6, knight to d5, removing the target. White to move. Castling is the most played move. Rajabo played bishop to g4. Bishop to e6. If bishop takes on g4, queen takes on g4 and white is happy. Bishop to e6. Castling. If bishop takes on e6, f takes on e6, and black is happy. Back to our game. Castling. g6, intending f5. Bishop takes on e6 now. f takes on e6. Knight to c3, queen to e7, queen to d3. Rook from a to d8, rook from a to d1. a6, a3, king to g7, queen to g3 h5. Lady commenting at the World Cup said that this is Alpha Zero's move. Where was Alpha Zero when Aljahin played these moves? The game continued. Knight to e2. d5. Queen to c3. Rook to f6. Queen to c5. Queen to f7. If queen takes on c5, knight takes on c5. This position 5 is white. Queen to f7 was played, c3, h4, h3, it is black to move, and this is the critical position of the game. Dingleren played rook to d7, queen to c7, would be the best move in a classical game. Dingleren would probably find this move. This move is preventing the white queen from coming to b6, as simple as that. Back to our game. Rook to d7. Queen to b6, intending knight to c5. White is better. Rook to e7, knight to c5. King to h7, b4. There was another move that was asking to be played, and that is knight takes on a6. And after pawn takes knight. Queen takes knight. And white is standing much better. Back to our game. B4. The threat is more powerful than the execution. Sometimes. Black to move. D4. Ding Liren is desperate to make some complications. Knight to D3. C takes on D4 is also fine. And after E takes on D4. F4. And white is better. Back to our game. Knight to D3. Keeping the position closed, perhaps easier to calculate. Rook to d7, queen to c5, d takes on c3, queen takes on c3, bishop to h6, a4 intending b5, knight to d4, knight takes on d4, e takes on d4, queen to c4, queen to e7, knight to e5, rook to c7, queen takes on d4. White is a pawn up. And white knight on e5 is a powerful piece, especially in the blitz game. Ding Liren was in trouble. He had to win this game to stay in a race. A draw meant Rajabov is a winner. The game continued. Bishop to f4 attacking the knight on e5. Knight to g4. Rook to f7. e5. Rook to f5. b5. a takes on b5. A takes on b5, g5, 
b6, rook to c6, white to move. What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? Rajabu played queen to e4. Let's take it back. Most players would play queen to d7, especially if they had only seconds on the clock. Do you agree? After queen takes queen, rook takes queen, check, king to g6, rook takes on b7, bishop takes on e5, rook to b1, white should be winning. Back to our game, queen to e4, Rajabov spotted a lovely pattern. Rajabov didn't panic, his brain was working extremely fast. Rook takes on b6, this is the move Rajabov predicted, why to move? What did Rajabov have in mind when he played queen to e4? Please pause and find the best move for white. Did you pause? What did you find? Did you find this move? Rook to d7. Wow, what a move. What a move. He saw the pattern in seconds. Queen takes rook. What else? And then knight to f6. Check. Forking the king and the queen, the rook on f5 is pinned. King to g7, knight takes on d7. In a classical game, Ding Liren would resign. But since both players had only seconds on the clock, the game continued. Rook to b5, queen to c4, rook to d5, knight to c5, rook from f takes on e5, knight takes on e6, check. And this is where the game ended. Ding Liren was also losing on time. For the entertainment purpose, I will show you just one line. King to g6, knight takes on a 4 check, g takes on a 4 queen takes on a 4 Rook to h5, defending the pawn on h4. Rook to b1, b5. Rook to a1, rook from d to f5. Rook to a6, check, king to g7, queen to d6. Rook to a7, queen to g6, check. King to f8, queen takes rook. And I guess we can stop here. Congratulations to Timur Jabov on winning the World Cup 2019. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.